Hello beautiful people from the internet, it is Connie over here and today I am at the beach parking lot because I was planning on recording this video at the beach but first of all it's almost starting to rain and I don't want it to start raining on me and second of all it's a Sunday and the beach is kind of full of people which I didn't realize because I thought today was a Monday for some reason but anyway here we are back in my old little cute car and I'm going to be talking about something that I find very interesting honestly which is why I don't drink alcohol because as a 21 year old I feel like a lot of people my age are starting to drink alcohol and by that i mean they've been drinking since they are 16 but only now they are like legal and they are starting starting to get tired of drinking alcohol so everyone at 21 is kind of like settling down with the alcohol usage but we'll just say they're now starting to try it because it's a legal age i mean in america in portugal is 18 years old but basically what i mean is a lot of people my age and younger really love drinking alcohol and going to parties at night and having alcohol then and i will talk about why i don't as a cigarette smoker, which is interesting because if you already do something that's really bad for you, why don't you just drink alcohol as well? So yeah, I'm going to be talking about that while smoking a Camel Activate. Let me not show you the picture. Very good cigarette, honestly. Was not expecting this much from it, but let's light this up. Let's park this up, as we tubers say it, and let's start talking about it. So I feel like I have two main reasons. The first of them is that I don't like the taste of any alcohol. I've tried beers, like apple ciders I kind of like, but th those are the only like alcohol beverages, alcoholic beverages that I like the taste of, apple ciders. But then I've tried like just plain beer from very different brands. I've tried vodka, gin. Yeah, that's about it. After those, I kind of gave up, I guess. But my first reason is just because I don't like the taste and I feel like if I have to add, for example, Coke, Coca-Cola to an alcoholic beverage for me to be able to drink it and like it, then why am I drinking it? You know, if I really don't like the taste, why am I forcing myself putting other juices in it just to like it? You know, if I don't like it, then I don't like it and I need, don't need to drink it, I guess. But I find it very interesting how there was a phase when I was like freshly 18, which is a legal age in Portugal to drink alcohol, where I really wanted to try, you know, I just wanted to try what it felt like and what, what the different alcohols, alcoholic beverages tasted like. So I tried, I, I, I feel like I tried some more, but I really don't remember what I tried because it was like three years ago and I have the memory of a squirrel, but But I remember that I was a, at a party, a party, like a social gathering on one of my friend's houses. Um, and I wanted to try like Coca-Cola with vodka for the first time. So I tried that and I can't do anything with moderation. All right. I really tried it and I had a bunch of cups because I just really wanted to feel like what it feels like to be drunk. I don't know. I was 18. I was like, I want to try things. You know that phase. So I drank way too many cups and everything just started spinning. I was laughing, I was walking around, acting like a dum-dum in front of all of my friends. And then one of my dear friends chased after me with bread and was like, you need to eat, you need to eat. Cause he was like seeing that I had too much alcohol in my system. So he was like, you need, you need to eat. And he was chasing after me with the bread and I ate. And then I just laid in a couch or whatever it was. And I was like, why am I doing this? I don't like this sensation. I feel completely out of control. I'm acting like a fool. I don't even like the flavor. I guess I don't like alcohol, you know? That was my one of my first and last experiences with alcohol. And I feel like in all aspects in my life, I hate not having control, like full control of what's happening around me. And when I drink alcohol, or when I drank at that time, I felt completely out of control. And I really don't like that feeling, you know? I like being aware of what I'm saying and the way that I'm acting and the way that I'm putting myself out there for people to see. Like, I don't want people to see a version of me that I have no control over, you know? So that's kind of why I don't like drinking alcohol because I feel like it's a very easy way to lose control of yourself. A lot of people enjoy that sensation and, you know, good for you, like really great for you, but I just don't really enjoy it. Also, I find it really funny that this is, I don't know if this is true in every country, but like here in Portugal, at least, if you say that you smoke one cigarette a day, as I do, People can give you like kind of a side eye, but if you say that you drink two bottles of wine, 
every night people are like oh my god you're so fancy like living the life drinking alcohol like what what do you mean you know it's kind of there's these double standards where being an alcoholic is fun and like wow cool but smoking cigarettes is like what are you doing to yourself you're killing yourself and your body make it make sense you know it doesn't make sense so yeah my main reasons are tastes bad in my opinion and i just don't like losing control really like and that's the same thing with uh weed when i smoked i always felt like i was out of control of my body but I've, i i kind of liked that sensation because every time i was smoking weed i was only with one of my other friend who like knew me very well and i kind of i was i felt comfortable and safe you know but I feel like every time I would drink alcohol, because it's something that I don't particularly like the taste of, I would be in a social setting with more people. So if I lost control, I would be in front of more people. I don't know. I just don't really like the sensation that alcohol gives me. I feel like it warms my body a lot. I start getting red and anxious. Not for me. Now, Siggy's though, they are for me. These Camel Activate Blue, I have really, not blue, like they have a blue pack. I don't know why I keep calling it blue. It doesn't say blue anywhere, but it has a blue pack. So I guess that's why I call it blue. But these have been really nice. I've been really enjoying them. Look, I usually don't even smoke cigarettes until the end of them because I feel like they taste kind of bad near the filter. But this one I've been smoking like to the filter every time. Like I know it's time to put it out when it starts burning my fingers. So it's about now, but I'm still gonna try to take one last hit. But yeah, fellow friends of the YouTube community, for people that have been asking me what kind of beverages of alcohol I like to drink, I don't like any of them. I feel like they kind of taste bad. I went through a phase where I was drinking like one cup of red wine here and there when I was in college just because, like when I was taking exams and exams were online and I was very stressed about it, I would be taking my exam on my computer and have a cup of red wine next to me because I just felt like it would, help me ease the anxiety it didn't it made me feel a little bit more anxious which i don't know why from for some people it soothes their anxiety and maybe for some people it enhances their anxiety me but yeah that is the reason why i don't drink alcohol who knows maybe one day i'll start enjoying it more but as for now i really like apple cider it's really good like from one portuguese brand specifically called bandido do pumar it's very good sweet and tastes a lot like apple i just think i like apple juice you know cut the, the beer from there i like apple juice i guess that's it so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i will be back very soon bye